This was a good little clip talking about Australia. I'm I'm not quite sure what it is in Australia that has these people just literally losing their mind. Now this is a video showing so they use PCR tests and if you test positive, well then you can no longer stay at home. So I believe they're doing like random tests on individuals. And if you test positive, then they escort you to currently in this video, you'll hear them. They talk about them. They're taking them to uh, hotels, as you can see, removing people from their homes for the beer bug. And this is an Australian. You can see police and PPE. The guy has a PPE gown on. Which is stupid because and it just goes to show you a lot of these individuals are just uneducated because this is not what you use PPE for. PPE is if you're going to come in contact with bodily secretions, like, for example, if I was doing a, a wound care, right? if I was doing a wound care or if I was bathing a patient that was bed bound, I had, you know, voided in the bed or had a bowel movement, etc. Right. Then you would wear some form of PPE. So if anything was going to splash on you, it would splash on the PPE and then you could dispose of the PPE. But if you're walking up to a man and you're going to see these individuals, very, very healthy and you know, fit gentlemen and on top of that he has a mask on so it just goes to show you that overwhelmingly the public is just so un, so uneducated and of course this comes at the top from the people who tell them what to do but i see this exact same thing in the community i'll see people wearing gloves and they but they touch everything they touch their purse they touch their wallet they touch their glasses and these individuals don't understand that, you know, the purpose of using PPE is you use it in the moment. Like if you're going to wear a pair of gloves, meaning I'm going to do something right now. I'm not going to touch anything else because then you're contaminating the gloves. And the purpose is to keep the gloves, the gloves clean. And if you were doing a wound care, like I wouldn't touch a wound, start doing a wound care and then reach into my pocket to pull something out. Right. That's not proper etiquette. And when you're wearing PPE. And I see this exact same thing. I see people on the train and they're using gloves. They reach into their, they reach into their bag, et cetera. And it just makes no sense. It's like, why are you doing this? Because you're literally touching everything that you're not supposed to touch with PBM. But Australia done lost their mind. Check out this video. It's a quick 30 second video. Checking in on a positive case at Greystains. Police in full PPE. As they break the news to Gabriel Chalu, he's off to a health hotel. Well, I went and got tested for peace of mind. Didn't get a text message that I'm positive or negative. And uh, yeah, next, uh, about a week after, I've got police calling me. So I don't know, maybe it's a mix-up. Confused but happy to comply, the concrete heads off for an indefinite stay. All good? Thank you. Beautiful. And you heard right at the end for an indefinite stain, meaning you have to test negative to get out. So they quarantine you in these quarantine hotels. Currently what they're using are hotels, but they're talking about building facilities to house these individuals. And as you can say, they say, hey, the, the, the news reporter talked about an indefinite stay into these areas. And you can see the individuals full PPE. They got masks on visors or goggles and it just goes to show you just the, the woefully ignorant actions of individuals this person obviously not even symptomatic walking around all he did was test positive via a pcr via a pcr swab which is silly because the whole point of taking these individuals in because now you're wasting money housing all these individuals when they're not even infectious and again this is just the beginning of the lunacy that you're experiencing, that we're, we're basically watching unfold in Australia. And it is not going to end well. It is not going to end well.